Good morning, everybody. I'm so happy and excited to welcome you to the Delta Electronics booth at the SPS 2022 Automation Show. We are happy to show you our latest products and our newest solutions. Please come with us on the booth tour. Good morning, Simone. Nice Good to morning, see you morning. here. What are you going to show us today about, the, about Codesys? Today, I'm going to show you our Codesys-based controller series which is called AX. In 2020-2021, we released the first two devices within this series. The AX8, a powerful industrial PC with either Windows 10 IoT or Linux as operating system, able to control up to 64 EtherCAD servo drives, and additionally with, uh, with robotics and CNC functionalities. And the AX308E, which instead controls up to eight axes. But now we have extended the scalability of this product range by introducing three new motion controllers, the AX304EL, the AX316E, and the AX364EL, as well as two PLCs, the AX300N and AX324N. All of them are compatible with the existing Delta ASIO modules that can be directly connected to the right side of the CPU and support the same array of communication protocols, Ethernet IP, Modbus, TCP, Modbus RTU, and OPC UA, with no need of additional licenses or external modules. Uh, the AX3 PLCs, uh, whose difference is just the availability of the built-in uh, IOs, are the first Delta PLCs based on codices, and offer a higher program capacity and execution speed compared to the other Delta PLC series. While the motion controllers, the AX3 motion controllers, all have an intricate interface, uh, but different motion control capabilities, up to four, eight, 16, and 64 axes, respectively. It is also worth to mention the other embedded interfaces. For example, uh, for the motion controllers, uh, the incremental and SSI absolute encoder interfaces, the fast digital inputs and the fast digital outputs that allow to control up to four servo drives or separate motor drives by pull strain, and the always useful serial ports, RS-232 and RS-485. Uh, to program these devices, uh, we provide an engineering tool called Dia Designer EX, which is the integration of the well-known automation software Codesys in Dia Studio, the Delta engineering platform that also includes other tools uh, for programming and configuring Delta products like HMI panels, um, servo drives, uh, and inverters. So in a few words, the Designer EX uh, makes the uh, whole uh, software development process uh, easier for both simple PC applications and complex motion, co motion control tasks, including functions like single axis and multi-axis movements, gearing, electronic camps, and interpolations. Of course, in accordance with international standards like IEC 61131 and PLC Open. So, uh, a full set of interfaces, uh, support of many different communication protocols, flexibility in software programming, and scalability, make the AX series suitable for a wide range of applications in many different market segments, such as packaging, metalworking, woodworking, and assembling. Uh, for example, the new entry, the AX304EL, could be the ideal product for an assembly machine that requires only simple point-to-point -point movements and a limited number of axes. While on the other side, the AX8, thanks to its uh, higher processing power and, the, and thanks to the, uh, in the integrated kinematic transformations, can be used for pick and place applications based on robotic arms like uh, SCARA, uh, Delta, or Articulated, even in combination with a vision system. Thank you very much, Simone, for that interesting take on Codesys products that Delta has to offer. We'd now like to move to the uh, new products panel with a focus on AS products. Hello, Ufuk. Can you tell us a little bit about the new developments in the AS PLC world? Thank you very much, Monique. First of all, I am very happy to welcome all the visitors during the SPS in person, as well as you joining us virtually. About your question, Monique, I guess this is the right place to talk about the new developments. 
because here we are standing just next to the new products panel. Here you can see the overview of the new products that we are going to release soon. However, I want you to focus on bottom left corner of the panel. Here you can see our new industrial IoT function card. This function card will bring ultimate flexibility for AS300 PSC series. Before I go into details of the features, I want to talk about why we have called it as industrial IoT function card. Well, when we say industrial IoT, what is the first thing that comes up in our minds? Most probably many things, right? Connectivity, predictive maintenance, data availability. So there is a variety of industrial IoT applications. However, there is always one thing in common, data, specifically quality data. So we have to make sure that our controllers are capable to gather the data from the machines running on the, running on the plant floor and make this data available for industrial IoT applications. Because without data, IIoT cannot work. This is why we have developed AS FFTP01 function card to make the data available for industrial IoT applications. It also helps to eliminate extra gateway from the plant floor and reduce the cost. So here in this function card, we have developed built-in web server functionality. This web server functionality is to create a customized dashboard to provide the data in an understandable format. So this dashboard is powered by Node-RED. Node-RED is low-code development environment. Maybe it is new for some of us, but it is becoming popular, for especially for the industrial IoT applications. So it is browser-based. Simply, we can open a browser to create a customized dashboard. This function card also supports MQTT protocol to integrate with the cloud platforms. So uh, we developed MQTT protocol to make it easy for your applications to integrate with the cloud applications without any extra gateway. This function card also supports OPC UA. OPC UA is open protocol uh, that enables secure and reliable communication between missions and the other platforms, such as SCADA systems, for instance, VT SCADA. And it is not over yet. This function card also supports FTP server that enables users to connect to the missions and get the log data directly. So what's our focus here? Our focus is to give the flexibility to our customers to integrate their applications with other platforms and encourage them to get benefit from industrial IoT applications to increase the efficiency and the productivity of their process. So we have developed AS FFTP01 card for the AS300 PSC series. I've already tried it out and it's quite straightforward and I'm sure you are going to like it too. So please leave us your feedback in the comments whether you like it or you have questions. We would love to hear more from you. Thank you very much for listening. Monique? Thank you, Ufuk. Hi, Nick. Hi, Monique. Nice to see you. What do you bring to the game? So, to put it in context, uh, let me ask, what is the biggest event of these days? Well, apart from SPS automation, I would say the World Cup. I do agree with you. So, let us see this uh, Delta Electronics offer is some kind of dream team of top-level automation products. What does your product bring to the team? So, my subject, uh, VTSCADA, serves the purpose of uh, control and monitoring of industrial processes. So, it communicates with uh, a huge variety of very different and multiple field devices, uh, taking information from thousands of data points and representing it graphically on PCs, on panels, on mobile devices, I suppose it uh, corresponds to the role of a uh, playmaker that control uh, the flow of, uh, let's say, team play in a very precise and very efficient manner. That's an interesting analogy, speaking of the greatest players of all times. Michel Platini, Maradona. Ruud Gullit or Marco van Basten. 
Of course, Oranje Power. Of course, Oranje Power. Now, these players and managers manage to perform under extreme pressure. How do you think Viti Skada performs under this pressure? I do agree the real value of a champion is revealed under duress at a crucial moment. In our case, working in complex architectures with demanding volumes of data. So Vitis Kata provides huge scalability without need to restructure the project. And you could easily do redundant configurations with double, triple, etc. redundancies. And even uh, to share workload uh, between several multiple servers. So in any application, any critical application, where performance and robustness are key factors, Vitiscada is a clear favorite. How easy is it to play with Vitiscada? As our, our favorite uh, uh, soccer player, Johan Cruyff, has indicated, football needs to firstly and foremostly be simple. Is that the case with Vitiscada? This is exactly the case with Vitiscada. I mean, simplicity is our second name. Uh, just imagine you get all classic uh, SCADA care core components just in a single installation in one um, setup exe file. It includes a uh, building historian, alarm server, more than 100 communication drivers. And this is because we provide everything by ourselves without need to go to third uh, part manufacturers. As a result, it does not compromise security. And finally, just take a look at the price list. It's the shortest in the industry. But speaking about such a price for such a star product, what will this cost the customer? I would confess you uh, an astonishing fact. You could reinforce your automation team immediately, right away, and with no cost. Just go to vitiscada.com webpage and download a special version of Vitiscada. It is called Vitiscada Lite. Uh, it has a limitation of 50 tags, but otherwise uh, provides the full capacity of um, the industry most powerful SCADA software. Wow, you are really excited about VT SCADA. Yes, I am. And because I believe that the Delta team that actually is full of uh, world-class hardware players uh, got a very new software superstar. So what could be, I mean, more important for a team to, su to succeed in a long-run championship? Thank you, Nick, for that really exciting presentation and conversation about VT Skada. Now let's move on to Mohamed, who's going to talk to us about the integration of Delta products in solutions. Hi, Mohamed. Hi, Monique. What can you tell us about the pump solutions and the Delta products integrated in them? Yeah, pump solution. Let me, uh, today I'm going to share with you uh, our state-of-art technology for pump application, starting here with uh, the pump drive. What we use here, we use a CFP2000 uh, uh, pump drive, uh, in which it is mainly uh, designed for HVAC and pump, uh, pump applications. And this kind of drive, uh, you can actually, it comes with IP55 housing. And uh, looking at the uh, outstanding functionality which, which this drive has, it actually reduces the amount of time that you need to commission your application. This drive also has a built-in POC, and it comes with optional cards for different communication and different industrial communication protocol, which is, fits your application. Looking at the different configuration for, the, for that drive, which can use for pump control, one of them is a very simple, which you can just one pump, one drive, but you can also have this drive controlling multiple pumps. And, in that, and we have also for more advanced application where you need uh, redundancy. In that case, we can use multiple pumps and then we, ha we have the uh, multi, multi master functionality and floating master functionality. Moving from the drive to the HMI, what we have here as a local HMI, which we use to monitor and control our uh, process, but you can also adjust and modify your uh, process parameters and engineering parameters. We have wide range of HMIs, starting from three inch to 15 inch, and it can support also different kind, can different kind of communication. As everyone know, usually pump station, it's uh, located remotely and unmanned, and that requires remote supervision and remote monitoring in order to have uh, uh, to optimize the operation of, of the pump. For that, we have our solution. Let me introduce our uh, remote 
uh, uh, solution. It's actually our industrial IoT, one of our industrial IoT solutions, in which we use our DX routers to, in order to connect to the field devices, to collect the data, and then we send the data to the cloud. And then sending the data to, to the cloud can, can be done using 4G or WAN or Wi-Fi. Once you have the data to the cloud, you have actually used the data, and using the data, then it comes to our uh, web-based uh, digital dashboard in which you can uh, customize your dashboard uh, for, for your application. And then you can easily build your own dashboard using drag and drop editor. And what also can you do in the dashboard is actually monitoring your alarms in which uh, you can actually do more analysis for your alarm test, for your alarming, and then you can plan your maintenance. And extra thing that you can also do uh, in, in, the, in the dashboard is actually uh, more advanced reporting for uh, uh, real-time or uh, historical data. As everyone knows, usually connecting the data to the cloud that is done using uh, uh, public networks, for that cybersecurity is crucial. And uh, for our DX router, or our actually data cloud, uh, is using uh, uh, secure tunnel communication to ensure uh, secure and uh, uh, integrity of data transmission. If you'd like to know more information about our uh, 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 pump solution with remote monitoring, please visit us if you are here in SPS or visit our website. And uh, yeah, we are waiting for any, any other questions. Thank you, Mohammed, very much for that interesting presentation. Thanks, Monique. That concludes our live stream today. Thank you very much for joining us. And for those of you who, who are online watching the live stream, if you have any questions, please do ask us in the chat. We will answer you. Or better yet, please come and visit us at the SPS show. We are in Hall 7, booth number 593, and we'd be happy to see you here. Thank you.